All right, new sinks are going in. One more day of sign painting for David. He's killing it. Your boy's tired. Good morning. Friday. Here we are, the 31st. The shop is almost done. Sager was here last night. We were here till 1 30, 2 o'clock. Health department came, approved. David left. He painted all the stuff. Shout out to Prime, Tom Signs, David Harwood. Beer is out of control. We're getting a phone call. Let's see if it's Alex or if it's the health department. It's Alex. Hello. Hey, whatever you want to do. It's whatever you want to do. Okay. So, I'm waiting on the business license, and I don't, I haven't really known what was going on. I joked in the other vlog, like, oh, I didn't really check zoning first. Well, I checked zoning right after that. But long story short, we're supposed to open tomorrow, and we're waiting on the business license, which means I'm waiting on zoning. I got a call this morning. The business license guy's like, we're waiting on zoning. They're confused. They thought you were a t-shirt manufacturer, not a tattoo shop. They're just, I don't know. We're waiting. I got, they got to get more information. But long story short, dog, I'm opening tomorrow. You know, the city's just got to catch up hopefully they get it done today but uh you know i plan on opening tomorrow it's real overwhelming building out an entire shop dealing with people's schedules and delays and money and the family just everything in this life there hasn't been a lot of documentation but today this wall has been waiting for decoration we had to build these little slats to create the wall the eve of april 1st also omar's birthday uh tomorrow Omar, it's your birthday. I'm gonna drill this thing into the wall and hang up the splash. We're gonna get breakfast. We're gonna knock this out. We're almost there. We're almost to the finish line. Almost. Let's hope. All right, March 31st update number two. Got this splash wall built for the most part. Well, we need another row for the top, but I'm just gonna put some up there and then I gotta go back and drill those in. It's looking sick. I'm going home to take a dab. We heard back from zoning. We are zoned, we are approved, and now we're just waiting to hear back from the business license people to issue the license. So it will go through today. We're opening tomorrow, really no matter what. Um, It's 10 o'clock. I really, you know, I have a lot of things to say and emotions about all the work and the last two months and just really the last six months and the last year, three years, five years, six, like life, man. Insane. Crazy. I have a lot of stuff that I could really talk about and uh, reflect on or all kinds of stuff. But I'm fucking exhausted. The shop's not even done. Uh, I gotta come back super early tomorrow, which I'm stoked. You know, it's been like a total labor of love. I've been up here non-stop just putting together what feels like a monolith to my career up until this point so we're gonna open tomorrow i don't really have any expectations i don't know how busy i'm gonna be i want to be available for people so i'm gonna like take walk in but i, I just wonder how fast i just you know i was just excited the future i wonder how fast or slow things are gonna happen so uh we're getting there you know i wanted to have this whole place you guys I wanted to have the whole place filled. I still have quite a bit of flash to hang tomorrow. A lot of it will be covered, but there's, you know, this concrete wall. I hate hanging shit on that wall. A lot of cool stuff has happened. Well, there's not a lot of life-changing stuff has happened to me on April 1st for a long time. Sometimes it skipped a year or two, but uh, I like April 1st. Yeah, man, I gotta get home. I wanna go hang out with my dog, celebrate his birthday. Get back up here at 6 a.m., 7 a.m., get to working on this, and probably open the shop at like 2 o'clock. But I gotta go to bed. It's been crazy. It's a wild ride. Whew, hot. Of course, got a jacket on inside, too. So. Alright, well, here we are. April 1st, the morning of. I was gonna get here at 7. It's, uh, it's 8 o'clock. I am tired, son. A lot of work. I did a lot of it myself. The help with Sager, Jeremy with the plumbing, and Kevin with the plumbing. I can't remember everybody else's name, but uh, yeah, it has been so crazy. I don't know. Like, I don't really know what to say about, um, about anything. I just have been activated. Uh, it's just time to keep working. I don't really feel like, I mean, like, yeah, the doors are going to be unlocked, and there's going to be 
people coming in and I'm gonna have tattoo appointments. But I still wanna paint all the flash myself, you know? So I'm gonna have to, all the flash on the walls, it's just gonna be placeholders for me to put my own sheets in. Also a huge task. So, we have a lot of work. But it's like, it's like life work, you know? It doesn't have to be done <clears throat> quickly. You just gotta get done. Mm. All right, well, here we go. Day, day one. <laughs> guys brand new morning uh today is april 2nd i have been up here most of the morning first off alex brought me a watermelon ginger juice so overnight oats our refrigerator this is something we haven't talked about our refrigerator has been broken for two weeks two weeks do you know what it's like living without a refrigerator for two weeks oh! Kill me, man! Oh, fuck! No! <laughs> it's fucked. No ice, no nothing. We tell you you can go buy a bag of ice. Yeah, you can. It melts. Literally preparing ourselves for fallout. So I know I can survive at least two weeks with no fridge at the house. I have a feeling that there would be no takeout fallout, so I wouldn't survive. Anyway, getting stuff together uh, online, you know, when you open a new business, there's the Google business, there's the Apple map. Getting the website ready, uh, setting up the phone number, you know, the call forwarding and the texting and all this. Deciding on business hours, which I think to start is gonna be from three to 9 p.m. for me because I have a lot of stuff to do. In the mornings usually, and that gives me time to kind of get stuff done. Plus, I like being here at night. You know, hours can always change. We're nowhere near done, but we're done preparing, and it's just time to, like, let the software live and update it as it lives. You know, you got to get the plane off the ground, and then you serve the drinks. I got all kinds of, I got all kinds of sayings for everything, you know? Good stuff. Good day. New fridge is on the way here today as well. Lots of business shit to do, and uh, I'm sure lots of tats coming. So I'm, I'm real excited to see where this all goes, so. Here we are, the beginning. Closed. We're closed Monday and Tuesday, but I am waiting on Alex because we have a mystery bag drop coming for friends and family tonight. So we gotta get some inventory, inventory, some inventory done, and then the public, if there's anything left, will be on the tenth. Yeah, then it'll be time to fresh start. Everything new. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> 